bar and playing in her so friend and I jumped into her car. Well, as the dance was over, straight to her bed did go. Well, little did I ever think to call my overthrow. So my go watching 30 pounds of pack of bags and fled and left me there stark naked alone upon the bed. But when I awoke in the morning, was nothing that I spy. But a woman shirt and apron upon the bed did lie. I tore my hair, I wrung my hands, I cried, What shall I do? Ah, tonight I'm bound for Wigglow's Town, no more will I see you. Well, as the streets were lonesome at the hour of two o'clock, I put on this shirt and apron and marched down to the docks. The crew, they saw me coming, these words to me did say, My dear old chap, you struck a snap since you've been gone away. Are those the new spring fashions that the ladies wear on shore? Where is the shop you bought them at and is there any more? The captain on the quarterdeck looked at me with a frown, saying, Jack, my boy, you better shoot for that for thirty pounds. I would, sir, if I could, sir, if I only had a chance. But I met a girl on Peter Street and she asked me to a dance. She danced my heart's deception, I got robbed from head to feet. And I'll take this oath no more, I'll go to a dance on Peter Street. Oh, you landsman and you seamen, no warning take by me. Be sure to choose good company when you go out on spree. Be sure to choose good company when you go out on spree. Or you'll find yourself in an apron to pitch you out for sea. Hup!